all looks so primitive. Hello everyone. Finally, it's time to showcase some action in Call of Dragons. Season TI, my first um, like big action in the New Kingdom. Uh, versus like similar power alliance, Steep and CPR. The names are actually kind of the same and like the power is actually the same. That's why it will be fun to just see how long range warfare will uh, like be in the action while fighting against kind of similar uh, power alliances. Whenever you are fighting against tier 5s, you generally don't understand uh, which kind of skills have an impact on you because they have too much power and you aren't gonna be testing enough. So let's see how we will perform here. As always, my main aim is to not get targeted. In order to deal damage, you need to stay alive. That's always the main idea. And let's see how much merits we can get out of this fight. I'm expecting a good amount. It was like first day since I healed my troops. I had like almost 1 million troops in my hospital, which is always a bad thing because like in, in the back of your mind you're always thinking that you can't do anything, you don't have enough troops, so yeah. I don't want to get hit by this artifact. Let's wait. This guy is just... Like whenever I see cavalry units, especially like same power players as me, I'm, I'm, I'm always going to kill them first. Let's move back to not get hit by Waldir and I will try to just simply stand here. Like as I said, I have long range warfare. Uh, I'm using uh, only ranged units in this fight. Hopefully this Darkling is not hitting my legion. Hopefully. Yeah, I don't think that's hitting me. And as you can see from a long range, I'm having a lot of fun. A lot of success currently. That's why I said if you are like maining marksman, you're only gonna have a better time than this. It's too windy for a safe shot here. Let's see if we're gonna sneak a small attack. Maybe this guy. Yeah, just move. Well, actually, I like the long range warfare, warfare in the season TI because uh, like, I'm a marksman main. That's the only thing I ever wished uh, whenever I was playing a marksman in past seasons to have a longer range. And I have nothing against it. I wish it will stay with us for future seasons. Uh, I'm not sure, but if, if it will happen, I will be more than happy. Because I like using marksmen whenever I have a long range. As you can see, there is no advantage in having uh, mages right now. That's why every single legion type is kind of viable. But I still think that... Um, Cavalry units need some love from the developers. Yeah, now I sometimes forget to use my artifact because I forget that I don't have enough range to use them, so... I think I need to get used to it because all the time I had it on automatic. Like as you can see, these guys are not that experienced in war situations because they are just moving up much especially if mage is moving up um, that means it's a free target right let's reposition and yeah until we have our infantry moving up we are 100 percent going with them let's see always i have my, like my own rules how i fight in general like, if i see infantry moving up it means that i need to move up and Things like that. Now we are just simply dealing free damage. I don't like that from the top side enemies flanking us, but yeah. Let's try to target this cavalry unit because yeah, whenever I see calves, I like feel like that's the easiest target. 
Like whenever I have a heart of Kamasi on my marksman, I'm at the time I'm dealing the most amount of damage in my opinion. Now yeah, we just got targeted. Let's move back. Uh, my legions are looking totally fine. That's the power of long range warfare in my opinion. I just have too much range. If we're gonna compare uh, the past seasons. Like, yeah, but generally, right now, mages don't have any advantage. Actually, they are even weaker uh, because Marksman has uh, many different attributes which make them good. Yeah, but like, what, whatever damage I just got was from purely artifacts, which you will generally get hit. It's impossible to fight and not get hit by artifacts. That's like... I should not even mention it when I'm fighting in wars. Um, in my opinion, uh, if you are playing with marksmen, you are 100% playing with Wilderberg. The additional 5% uh, damage tilt is great. And in general, if you are playing as a Spring Warden, you are playing as a, a cavalry player. If you are playing with League of Order, then you are Mage, and if you are playing with uh, Marksman, you are 100% uh, Wilderberg. Also, like flying units of Wilderberg, you are getting additionally uh, another Marksman unit, and yet you will have four to three Marksman hero pairs. Generally, I advise if you are a Marksman player, just play Wilderberg, you will be happy about it. Yeah, so far. I'm actually happy about my long range warfare. How much damage I'm doing. Let's just use artifacts. Not just over chasing, which I'm 100% going to get hit. That's what happens whenever I'm using artifact, unfortunately. Let's try and let her run. Yeah, actually, my legions are still alive. I can even go back. That's, that's what happens whenever you are fighting against the same, kind of same uh, power level alliances. You are generally having way more fun. Now, Heart of Gamasi will be turned on and I will be dealing a big amount of damage. I like this artifact, artifact especially for a couple of marksmen legions. Heart of Gamasi, like you, I'm, I'm just getting a lot of normal attack damage, which is always great. Soon I will send my legions back home uh, to refill. Unfortunately, my hospital is not uh, empty. I don't know why my units move in and out, but. Yep, yeah, if you are a cavalry player, you are playing Spring Wardens. If you are marksman, you are playing uh, Wilderberg. And if you are mage, you are. You are playing League of Orders. Uh, in my opinion, soon we're gonna get a new uh, faction, which will be mainly for uh, infantry players, because we are still lacking some infantry main uh, faction in the game. This Madeline is pretty tanky. Yeah, I almost avoided the artifact. I'm not sure why this guy is running for me. But yeah, he's going to get defeated. Um, let's kill him and let's try to refill. Because, yeah, my legions are already almost out. Well, um, marksmen and calves, uh, I would go for Wilderberg because Wilderberg has a more damage and generally. Uh, you won't gonna go too far with defense, especially if you are free to play player. So your cavalry units will benefit from that 5% uh, physical attack bonus. And your marksmen too. Uh, generally, I don't think like Spring Warden's marksmen are any good, in my opinion. Uh, I was mar I was Spring Warden player in the past. That was my first uh, faction in the game. Uh, I just changed it like this season, like two weeks ago on Wilderberg. And uh, like I like it super. 50,000 merits out of this fight, 11,000, so 16,000. Yep, I think it was a great 
uh, fight for us. Let's refill the legions and let's go back. Uh, let's try and see if we have something cool here. I wish we had uh, regeneration uh, mana stone here. But yeah, no problems, no problems. If you have any questions regarding game, uh, feel free to ask. That's why in general I turn on live streams because um, like, I'm not a pay-to-win player. I'm I'm on a zero dollars in this game. I'm just trying my best to showcase sometimes how wars happen and how in general you can position yourself to get more merits even as a free-to-play player. But my troops are not as, as many so I can't uh, participate in wars for hours and hours but until I can be fighting and I can be having stream on uh, feel free to ask any questions I will be more than happy to answer I will get this HP uh, it will help uh, during the war I wish I had uh, my hospital empty it will be super great in this uh, great fight Let's try and let's go back. Uh, I, I, I generated a good amount of merits out of this fight. Which is, I'm pretty happy. So I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm going to get even more right now. That's why, let's try and... Yeah, second full uh, team of marksmen. Uh, I'm super happy about long range warfare in general. Uh, that's a great, great addition. Like, I can feel the difference whenever I'm fighting with the same uh, power players like me. Uh, it's like the best uh, way of showing what it actually does. Whenever you are just hitting at your 5 player, and uh, of course if they are hitting you, you can't see anything because you are just dying. So, it's a great moment for me, uh, first time in this season, to see uh, how my lineup works, and actually, yeah. I got a great amount of merits, a lot of merits, like 15,000, 11, 16, 14, yep, I, I like, I like what I see. Let's go and let's participate, that's why we are here. Finally, I was waiting for some action uh, for my alliance in this season, and that's why this month we didn't have enough uh, live streams. But I hope uh, from this day we will have a lot more fun. And our merits are growing and growing, which is great. I am Do you intend to provoke me? At first, myself, I was thinking to going for a mage main but yeah in almost every single game which i have ever played i always liked playing with marksmen with archers so marksmen chose me it's a, it's the idea also we got the movement speed uh, buff from the seasonal talents which is also great i always wanted to have more march speed as a marksman But still, as you can see, uh, in general, marksmen and mages are like one of the slowest unit types in the game. It's still didn't change. It's still the case. But yeah, finally we are here. Now let's try and deal as much damage as possible. I, I just saw cavalry unit and I don't need to see anything else. I straight up went to pick it. I guess this guy is tier 5. If I'm not mistaken, I don't know why he has this mark, but no, he's not tier 5. Yeah, that was awkward. Generally, when you get a, a ping on some enemy, uh, you understand that that's a tier 5 player, but in this case I think he was not, he was not for sure. Yeah, now it's time for us to go and get some uh, free builder merits out of this, always juicy. Yeah. Let's 
go. Some juicy merits. Let's try and use artifact here, it will be much better. Come on, almost, right? Almost. Yeah. This artifact tunes, <laughs> I think, was amazing. Yet again, more merits, why not? This artifact doesn't catch, which is quite normal. Let's just kill this guy who is just dealing us free damage, which we don't like. We prefer not to receive any damage whenever we are fighting. I'm not sure why sometimes I my units just move up. That's awkward, but uh, in this case we are fighting against kind of same power alliance and it's not big of a deal whenever you are fighting against your five players one wrong move and you are dead that's the most unfun thing about this game whenever you are fighting against your five players but it is what it is i already got used to it and now it's time for me to enjoy the same power war Long range warfare is going amazing, currently, zero complaints, my legions are staying alive longer, I'm dealing much more damage, I think we're just gonna move forward and try to just kill these two legions. I'm not sure if he's going to be able to run from here. It will be hard. Yep. That was easy. And still, our legions are almost full health, which means this is the benefits of the long range warfare, which I love. I wish I had more war situations and less uh, full hospitals in order to test it even more. But for the first look, it looks amazing. Let's try and let's deal some damage to this cavalry player. But I don't want to get targeted, that's why I'm simply going to move back. And wait for enemy until they will make a wrong move. Which they are of course doing here. If we will be able to use our artifact will be amazing, but yeah, they are just moving big. Alright, alright. Yep, we just avoided the Phoenix Eye, which is great. In here would be a great placement for my own Phoenix Eye. Yep, that's a correct move. I'm not sure why these guys are moving up, but... Yep, that's the long range warfare's tactic, just use your range, you are playing right like a mage in this season, or season TI, and yeah, you are basically staying alive more, and you are dealing more and more damage, I love my build, which, it, it makes me happy whenever I understand that I made the, made the correct choice, that's always great thing to know. Yeah, these guys are just moving up, the on only damage I'm receiving, yeah, now I'm getting targeted, which I need to move back. But main uh, damage which I was receiving was from the artifacts, simply because I'm just too far. And I'm hiding with my own uh, alliance members. Now we are much less, that's why... Yeah, I don't know why he's trying to move up so much for me, but still a lot of time since we came from the uh, from the base because we are alive for a long time. This is the power of long range warfare. Like that's why I always advise to go for the most fun version uh, whenever you have a choice in this game. How we are doing? Targeted, we're gonna move back. 
if this cavalry player is running at us because nobody is targeting him, let's just try to kill him. Yeah, it's a great place to use some artifacts. Alright, that was amazing. That artifact use was amazing. It's a perfect moment to rush back. Let's see how much merits we are going to get. Just want to kill this guy because he's just moving up. Yep, I wish my uh, hospital was empty already. It would be much more fun to fight. Uh, because I would knew that I have a lot more legions to play with. Let's see if they will over uh, overstep and come forward. I don't want to get targeted by this darkling. Let's just change the position because here I see a lot of our members just standing. And maybe I will catch somebody who will just overstep. Yeah, like this guy. He just overstepped. Well, I guess he just wanted to use some uh, artifact. Which is also fine. I call it daybreak, but for you, it's lights out. You're still ready to unleash. I just face. see my whenever I see myself, I always move back uh, because there is no reason to ever get targeted whenever there is a lot of people you, uh, fighting. You always should use your position on your alliance members and never overstep. Yep, I guess this is the moment where nobody's overstepping. But finally, we got some tank moving up. Let's just choose a better target and oh, we are just moving up. Yep, it's target maybe. Yep, at least something. At least we are hitting something or someone. Now it would be amazing if I was able to use my Phoenix Eye somewhere here. Let's see if they are moving up. I guess they are. We hit at least two legions. Yeah, and now we are. Well, our legions are almost dead, and we are just going to try to deal as much damage uh, because soon it will be time for us to go home. I guess somehow this guy just got, got us targeted, which is always fine. Yep, as you can see, like 15, already like 15 minutes, I'm fighting with my marksman with no problem. But yeah, I guess now it's time to go home, refill. I will even use some resources, which I'll never recommend. Let's see. Uh, how we will be able to send more legions. Let's at first check the merits. Well, as I said, this is long range warfare 18,000, 16, uh, 24, uh, 23, uh, 15, uh, 11, and I am on a zero, zero dollars in this game, guys. That's I, how I always say that um, try to get as much fun. It's not mandatory to spend, but if you can spend, do whatever you wish. I'm showcasing that even playing, paying the zero dollars in this game, you can generally have fun and you can generally uh, get the satisfaction of getting a lot of merits in this game. Aha, <laughs> hi Mons, hi. Yep, I'm testing my long range warfare and as you can see, like, I guess this is my type of war, right my friend? Whenever I'm fighting against tier 5 players, I don't get uh, these kind of numbers. Like 15, uh, 23, 24, 16 and 18. I guess my time has come. Somehow, anyhow, it's done. And of course, I hope... Uh, 
this will continue in like whole season because last season was really rough I every single fight I understood that we were losing but yeah it's always fun whenever you are fighting against your like same similar power players because you actually can see your progression and you can actually see what you are choosing your choices whenever you are fighting against tier 5 uh, nothing really matters as a tier 4 player sick yeah like it's it's time for sickness my friend uh, after winter like in my country everybody is getting sick sick Wish you well, wish you, you will get back to your normal self, because soon we are getting some action in this kingdom, uh, which I'm sure you want to have it too. Of course I'm not going to speak about some stuff, but I think we're gonna have some action in this kingdom. At first it was kinda boring, uh, like just farming, I farmed for like uh, first two or three seasons my last like only job was farming because i was in a weak alliance last season we just like a lot of things changed but i i had the high hopes for this season i think we are going to have some fun here yep there we go you heard it from the guy himself yep that's that's what's going to happen for sure I'm going to save some elixirs um, until we're gonna have main fight. That's why I'm always trying to have my merits. Wait, where is the store? Here. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I will be ready. I, I will be ready for sure. Understood. Coordinates received. I, I still don't like the mark speed of marksmen. We are still very, very slow. Even though I chose to have a Gale of Step, sim simply because I hated my March speed for Marksman, but this is nothing. I, I don't feel any change. I'm still slow. I'm still waiting a lot of time until I'm gonna go. I'm not sure, maybe like Sip has way more online people, because I don't know, I, whenever I'm there, I'm I'm killing a lot of legions and I guess they are just way more online. Actually, I don't know about the history about uh, CPR and SIP. I think last season they were fighting. That's the idea I got from my alliance members. Two tier fives. Yeah, I guess one Madeline was kinda tanky. I had flashbacks of the last season. I think last season, like, CPR and SIP was fighting and my alliance got kinda happy when it was announced that we are fighting against that and like I generally don't like asking questions I, 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 I go the way I look so that's the impression I got let's wait until the legions will be here fully Let's try to deal some damage you now. Yep, well, honestly, uh, there was like a lot of um, ox, let's say like this. But a lot of people were saying that they just don't break the agreement. We like a lot of mad people, you know what I mean? Like, people just don't like when they're getting destroyed by tier fives. That's, I think, the normal reaction uh, whenever you are like not that experienced in wars. And I think this alliance is not that experienced in uh, like war situations. But, yep, I was the advocate at, like at first to not do some stupid, silly mistakes. Um, I have seen alliances making mistakes with tier 5 players and I, I have seen what happened with them, so... There were, there were some mad players also, trust me. Okay, 
But yeah, like in my opinion, uh, like there is a lot of betrayals in this game. Uh, I'm not that experienced in other Kingdom Builder games, but what I have seen in this game, like a lot of uh, betrayals, a lot of alliance changes, a uh, lot of allies exchanges, like in general I like to play with one alliance. Uh, from the day one I have been playing with one and the where I am right now is the second one. So I like I like the idea of community, I like the idea of sticking together, like even in good and bad times. For example, in my first alliance, we lost every single season. That's a funny part, right? Like every season season every single season we were losers. But a lot of players still kept with the same group because we just generally liked playing with each other with each other. Uh, it's not about always regarding like rewards, right? I, I have seen people hunting for rewards. I guess this guy is tier 5 because I'm receiving some damage. Yeah, let's just don't hit him. Let's see what best you can do whenever you know somebody is tier 5. <laughs> hi Bark, hi my friend. Yeah, actually, I'm surprised we are losing here, because I guess they have more players online. I just don't want to go overstep. Yeah, that's like... I think this too much sensitive people are playing this game, honestly. Um, like generally I play games uh, because I, I don't want to be in a live moment all the time and I get lost in games I'm just forgetting my life my like for example work or like in general real life stuff that's why I'm playing games if I will get mad and sensitive about the games I'm not sure if I will continue playing games in the future that's what I have been done since the childhood it was like a escape for me uh, as always Yeah, I, I, that's what I, I said. With the MPP, we lost every single season. Because we had zero tier 5 players. Uh, and we were uh, simply losing every single zone, every single uh, uh, behemoth battle. But yeah, still people kept playing with uh, each other because we just liked the community. Like, Bark was with us, uh, but for, for the different account, like, as I understand, Bark has 10 accounts in this game. Bark, if you want to see, I can show you some Marys, which I got. Come on, let's see. 18, 16, wait, wait, 24, 23. So, yeah, we are doing some damage here. I'm just trying to get a better position. Okay, let's let's focus and let's 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 make a good result because Park is making fun of us. We don't like it. <laughs> okay, all right, guys. For tier for player, twenty three is a lot. I'm sure you had a better scores, right? I'm I'm pretty sure. I'm getting like. This is the most merits I have got from a single fight, which I just showed, and I'm getting roasted, like, like come on. <laughs> right, like, why the hell I'm always clicking on this thing? Now I will focus and I will show you how much merits I'm gonna get. Just give me, give me a couple of minutes. Let's just remove this infantry. From our way, okay. I really like this artifact, Earth of Kamasi. Like whenever it's turned on, I, I just see how much damage I'm doing. Alright, now we, we made the mistake, we need to go back. But this guy made another mistake. It's too windy for a safe shot here. Yeah, we had uh, like almost every single member of us had like one million uh, troops in hospital, 
Actually, I used all of my saved elixirs which I got from you guys uh, right here to fight because my hospital was still full. And I guess it will be full for a long time in this season, which I prefer. It's always better to just fight and do something than just enter into the game, send the gatherer, beat, and in two hours go again. That's the most boring, in my opinion. Yeah, by the way, I'm getting lucky in terms of merits, not merits, like warpets. Like one star, one star, one star, tier two, I just got it like yesterday, one star, and one star. Like, like in something I'm getting luck, but what I want to get luck is artifacts, where I have like actually zero luck. I've got the right gear for any situation. I actually have zero luck. Thanks for subscribe. I, I think it's actually first time I hear this notification sound on the stream. At first I was awkward, like I didn't know what to check. Alright, now let's actually do why I'm here to kill some enemies. Okay. Let's just make a, get a better position because this guy is too close. Yep. Okay, let's remove the target and like we actually need to have at least one infantry here. It will be much much better because like as always one at least one infantry is must in every battle. Like whenever you have too much range players. Let's try to deal some damage here. Yeah, finally somebody just pushed with the infantry so I can move up. Yeah, I was trying to avoid this phoenix eye but yeah, it was almost impossible. Hiding with your alliance members is always a great idea. My favorite thing to do in this game. Yeah, I'm still having some legion, some troops. I don't want to go back. My hospital doesn't look beautiful. It actually looks ugly. Yeah, actually they have more people here. I think we just sent some uh, rally here. But if rally is there, we should be pushing. Okay, no coordination, fortunately. Unfortunately, no coordination. Maybe some sneak attack. But yeah, it's too late. It's too late. It's already too late. Recalibrating steering for new location. We generally need more people, I think. It's too windy for a safe shot here. Recalibrating steering for new location. Alright, you this guy is just giving this time bomb to my face. Thanks. Thanks for good memories, my friend. I'm not sure why everybody stopped overextending. I guess they understood how to play the game. Right. Let's try and deal damage from the back, long range warfare settings. Doing its job. I've got the right gear for any right to use my time to shine. Am I getting targeted soon? 
I don't think so. Let's try and use the artifact. Ah, horrible placement. Need me to do a little recon. Yeah, I'm gonna show it. Another bright idea. I'm all in. Yeah, these fights have been bad. We didn't have any makeup. It's a report. I'm getting targeted here. Like I always try to show reports whenever I'm sending my legion back because that's how I actually know how I did. This whole fight I have been getting roasted by Mons and Bart without my merits, so I kinda lost concentration. But let's see maybe maybe we can do something here. Finally, we got some infantry moving up. Finally, we are able to deal some damage. Sometimes my legions want like a couple of seconds until they understand what I'm saying to them, which is pretty awkward. I don't know why I'm getting targeted here, but still. Nobody should touch this rally. Yeah, 9000 from that fight. I guess my legions need to go home. But yeah. Let's just wait, waste it until we have it. Maybe some free damage to this infantry. Why not? I guess they are not that strong, they are not tier 5, so some free damage. Right, I will send my legions home and try my best to get at least one back. Let's see the reports. 9013 here uh, for Walder and Welling. For Nico and Kinara 15. Uh, 13 for Sindron and Rhaegar, 18 for Walder again. Well, actually, not a bad numbers, in my opinion, for Zero Spender. And actually, that's like my first fight where I have been using uh, like a couple of legions together. I have been always fighting with one, which have been uh, Nico and Kinara. And when my Nico and Kinara was going to die, I was using my Walder and Welling. So I'm like kinda learning how to use four legions together. Yep, like actually that's like first time I'm having these results in a war. If I I think if I was more focused in this fight I would have got gotten even more. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna use some resources because I'm getting a good amount of merits in these fights and I don't want it to stop, honestly. It was pretty rough last season, like almost every single enemy was still 5 and the maximum amount of uh, merits I was getting was 10,000 and that happened like 20% of chances. It was pretty rough last season yeah that's what I'm yeah yeah that's the highest merits I'm getting in that fights for me it doesn't really matter whichever legion I was clicking I, I knew I was going to die from the counter-attack damage or like if I was getting targeted I needed like two seconds and my legion was gone so that was the kind of fun I had last season and actually like seasons before as an MTP we had a zero tier 5 player every each of us were tier 4s and uh, for us every single fight was like that like you would just show up and your hospital has 1 million troops and I was healing like imagine fighting against tier 5 players all the time and getting resurged like 2 or 3 times every season 
that every reset was a headache for me. Like I was I was losing my mind. Well, in NTP, Bark had a different account. He had a tier four there, and like I think two seasons ago, I find out that he has a better account somewhere. Like, again, the one which he has right now. He he's a he, he should have a couple of more accounts. I think he, he's hiding some stuff. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm hundred percent using my resources here because I want to continue. I would not recommend any free to play player to do this, but I want to get some merits. This game is about war. I don't care. Uh, let's heal some marksmen and let's heal some. Okay, I have a lot of gold actually. Like in my in my every single video, I'm saying don't use your resources for healing, <laughs> and whenever I'm fighting uh, in wars myself, I always try to heal because I always want to fight more. Right, at least at least something, right? At least I can go there and have a little bit more fun. And of course we are losing too, so I need to be there. In this alliance, I, I can't have uh, like faith in my other alliance members because they don't have enough power to just come and destroy everybody. We need to show up, that's why I'm trying my best to do that. Is the... Is the pink the leader of these guys? Wait, let me check. Blue. Right. Okay, let's. Okay. New dramas are starting in our new kingdom. Let's go. <laughs> like, that's what I actually said. Uh, people are just too sensitive about the game. They just forget that in general games are to have fun. Not to fight or get mad about some actions. Because I think everybody here is gathered to get as much fun out of this game. Like if you are getting angry about some in-game situations and angry in a moment that you are like, like trying to make feel another person that you are angry, like yeah, you just you should just stop. That's why I generally don't like to uh, use chat in games. I'm not the type of person who is going to. Text. I like. I don't think. I understand in Call of Dragons and Kingdom Builder games, the like, community is getting built by uh, the chats and speaking with each other. But that's not my type of gameplay. To use keyboard. They are called like keyboard warriors, right? If I'm not mistaken. It's too windy for a safe shot here. Okay, finally we are here, and we have less and less people. Let's get every single legion close, and we will be able to... So I'm always scared that I'm gonna click on the Darkling, and that's a horrible moment to fight against Darklings. I don't want to move up. Even though, like, every single one of them are tier force. Here, why, why I should receive, like, useless damage to myself. If you, if you have some infantry, 
Let's wait for them. Yeah, this guy is blue. Yeah, I, I, I see this uh, leader is fighting here. Okay. Let's make him even even ahead. Let's see how sensitive he will be or she. I mean, I'm not actually sure. Yeah, somebody has a flame, like flame artifact, I just held it on my legions. Right. This guy just thinks he's a superman here. Now, like, they are just trying to target me, which I don't like. We have some builders here, they can target and they, they, I can take do some damage. Instead, for sure target the field. No, they are trying their best to focus to be builders, but let's just hide. Let's, let's make them overstep. Yeah, I, I could not choose the perfect position to stand still and attack. For now, let's see. We just don't have enough people, I think. I thought of our guys are maybe sleeping, maybe different time zone, but I would be more than happy if we had more people. Like I'm a marksman main, I can't. Bosk, well, my main idea is to play as a free-to-play player and to show that you can have fun and until it's pay to win and until it will break my streak of uh, playing as a zero dollar player. Hopefully I'm, like, that's my favorite hero to have actually, like, I'm, I'm almost awakening Kinara, I have like two levels left on the last skill. And if I had POSC it would be like dream come true, but yeah, it will ruin my game plan, which I said um, whenever I started the game. I still didn't buy the Lilia, because that's the plan, and I'm trying my best to follow the plan. Maybe in the future they will give us the ways of getting POSC, but for now, it's just a small dream, which I'm not sure when it will happen. Will I suicide here? I don't want to suicide here. That's not the guys I want to suicide. But yeah, like having uh, Hosk and Kinara is super fun. You are tanky. Uh, you are also dealing some damage, uh, Hosk is buffing you, also Hosk has a precision talent, which is amazing for marksmen. Yeah, I have been thinking about Hosk for a long, long time, but yeah, unfortunately, it's for Paytori. It will just simply ruin my whole game plan, uh, like, it will ruin uh, my channel's idea, that's why I'm resisting. Let's try and do some damage. Finally, I have some alliance members near. Yeah, finally, some great artifact use. Yeah, like I generally like the Heart of Kamasi. Whenever it's turned on, I, I feel how much damage I'm doing. Especially for same uh, kind of power players like me. Yeah, I just made the wrong move and I overextended, which is fine. But yeah, now you just made me remember about Hosk and I will be thinking for a while, then I will make myself stop to continue with the plan. But yeah, for now it is where it is. 
it's it's a game plan. If it will change in the future, I'm not sure. It's the idea of the channel to showcase that uh, even uh, if you are not planning to pay in this game, you can still download it, you can still play it, and you can still have some fun. And of course, for us, for players who are playing this game for a while, uh, new and more players will be better for our own game. Uh, we will have more some more events, some more uh, money in the game, uh, which will help developers to get more cool events and in general progress game because whenever people are leaving the game and no new games are coming up uh, no new events it's getting boring uh, like whenever you see in a kingdom that there is way less people than in the past you are like uh, your interest is going down let's see the merits i think in the end we just we did some damage well actually not so much in these fights, I think that more than 10,000 merits should be on almost every single um, legion. But yeah, the position was awkward. Yeah, it is what it is. We just used our behemoths here, which means we can push up. Yeah, some free merits here. Let's go. Like, I'm super happy that I was able to run on the stream because I missed streams in March. I had zero streams. Last season was kind of fun in that uh, way because I was able to participate in many wars and run on the streams. Yeah, some builder merits. I'm not sure if I'm like only one who is hitting the tier 5 builder there or why it was not getting the damage. Yeah, average Phoenix Eye. This guy should die. I guess this guy. Right. Feel like I have I I have zero levels on my shadow blades, which is YMP. All right, I will remember. I still have zero levels on my shadow blades, which I don't like at all. I wish I got at least of like two levels on it, which would be. I'm not going to touch YMP. That's the damage I I got. Of him. Let's try and click on some mage players because that's why I chose the long range warfare to kill some mages. Yeah, that's our only uh, tier 5 player which finally came. Hello, my friend. You have been missed. And yeah, the difference is huge. He just brought that tier 5, uh, I guess, infantry, and he's moving, and the enemy is moving back. That's what happens whenever you have tier 5 player. That's what I'm kind of get was getting used, but now I'm going back from my for my old ways of fighting, which is fine too. Yeah, 14,000 merits out of that fight. Totally fine. And I think I'm going to get even more here. Uh, simply because my artifacts are almost ready. Alright. Yeah, I guess my tier 5 is uh, still there and I will be... Okay, there will be some artifact use. Yeah, it got kinda laggy, but the artifact was getting used there. Yeah, the Umbra was easily our only tier 5. I think like today I was just scrolling on my YouTube and I just saw the Umbra's channel. He was trying to make some videos about the game, but he actually stopped. 
last video was published like a week ago, like four months ago. I guess I'm going to. Okay, come on, let's just do that. Yeah, I just stayed, why not? I think I will be able to send a couple of marksmen. Uh, legions. Yeah, let's send this Syndran and Phragar back. At least I will save this 100k uh, legions. Okay, why you are moving that way? I clicked on back and he chose the worst uh, road to go home. I guess the behemoth drop was pretty fine. Uh, yeah, merits look actually good. 90,000 on Syndrome and Kragar, which is both of them 5111. Uh, Pia and Craig. Pia yeah, is not upgraded. It's still in low levels, but still 18. 19 on my best march. Nigo and Kinara. I have been using all of my legendary tokens on uh, Kinara. Yeah, nice amount of merits. Finally, like I can see that I'm doing something in this wars. New experience for me. But yeah, I'm not sure if I will be able to uh, send my wyverns, but I think I'm able to send my marksmen, at least a couple of legions. Let's see. You are not going home, my friend. Uh, by the way, Mons, like, what do you think? Whenever I'm gonna awaken my Kinara? Like, what's the second... Like, for me, Kinara is first best marksman in the game. Uh, if that's my opinion. What could, would you recommend to choose for the VIP shop? Like, second marksman hero. Because I think, like, Nico, I'm getting Nico's tokens from uh, gold crests. I have been thinking about Sindrion. Yeah, Sindrion, right, yeah. That's only second skill is the useless skill for me, because uh, as a tier 4 player, I'm not going to initiate rallies. But yeah, even though, like, I have 5 one, one, one I'm still getting some merits from this Sindrion Legion. I thought like he was super good uh, awakened before it was like kinda normal, but like 5111 and I'm still doing some things with the same players as me. Which is yeah, my surprise. I'm liking it even more. I was super happy when I got it, actually, uh, on season ending rewards. I was super excited. Yeah, that's the hero I wanted to have, and I think right now I have almost every single marksman hero. And uh, like soon, I think we are going to get um, uh, garrison marksman. It's time to have the garrison marksman because we have infantry, of, call, of course. Uh, we have cavalry, we got Tohar for mages, and uh, like next two. Uh, marksman uh, heroes, one of them should be the garrison one. Yeah, like that's that's always bad. Like, whenever I got like even one on this engineering skill of Nicole, it was like really bad. That's why I think I'm gonna collect my gems, not gonna spend on anything, and whenever I'm gonna see this new marksman heroes I will try to get both of them like I'm pretty sure there will be heroes in this game which I will never get uh, but uh, at least if I'm maining the marksman uh, I will I will try my best to have every single marksman hero in the game well I guess I can send another Daybreak loaded and ready to go. another group I'm kinda enjoying playing with the, like four legions. Like in the past I was always using one. Whenever it was dead, I was using second. That's how I was like kinda saving my hospital not to not to get too full. 
But since I'm fighting against like kind of same power uh, level players like me, I think I can can use it. So I will practice this new style for me. Advance or retreat. I think this will be our, our last uh, fight with these legions because I don't have hospital. I know I have a lot of merits which I can spend. Yeah, of course I'm gonna spend it, but I would prefer to have more elixirs here, so I would continue fighting. I will be saving some more elixirs for the future fights, which I think will be much more important than this uh, fight with Sip. I think this uh, Sip fight will be perfect way for me to collect as much uh, elixirs as possible. Well, if you like those horror hero pairs, if you want to use uh, Ginara on Nikov and uh, like Sunjan and Freigar, of course. Another way for Hosk, like why not with uh, how it's called Gwenwin? Until we're gonna get any other marksman, until ma any other marksman will be here, or simply because like I like this new seasonal talent, which is uh, Hertz as one. As much ranged units you're gonna have on the battlefield, the more attack, 1.5%. Uh, so let's say you have five marksmen uh, legions, like not only marksmen, right? Mages are ranged too. Yeah, Thea is Craig. Uh, I have Thea uh, with the PvP talent tree. I actually asked Bark. And he told me that uh, not a lot of people are using the PvP talents. They are mainly going for overall. So I like, let's say I, I will test it. I'm not sure how it will work for tier 5, but for like same power players, it, it works pretty fine. Like, it's pretty clear that we are getting uh, one flying marksman hero, that's for sure, and one uh, garrison marksman hero. That's why I think. Uh, like if you will use Gwenwin, you're gonna change it to the, with the new hero, and uh, like Craig will be changed in the, in the future with like new uh, marksman flying hero. In the... Yeah, yeah, and actually, yeah, it's a perfect time to have some fun with marksmen, right? I'm not sure if we're gonna have these seasonal talents like next season. Maybe it's uh, season TI's thing, you know, like. It might even happen, but like uh, maybe they will bring something else in the future. That's why I changed to Wilderberg. Uh, like I decided to play with a couple of marksmen. In first time in this game, I'm using a couple of legions. So yeah, if you want to have fun, like yeah, it was kind of same with the uh, flying cavalry units, right? Until the Forondil, uh, when Forondil came, like the flying cubs got a like kind of idea how it should be played. I think it's same with the marksman. We generally don't have a legendary marksman hero uh, for flyers. Like Craig is epic. Thea is good and used almost everywhere. It's you won't gonna call Thea uh, the main marksman flying hero. So yeah, I think whenever new. Uh, flying hero will come into the game. Like Wyverns will have a idea how it should be played. Right now it's kind of like uh, Wild Wild West. Whatever you can use, you are using it. Not sure why I'm the only one still fighting. I thought we kind of we were kind of winning. Yep. Like flying calves. Like in general, if you are here for player, I don't think you should touch cavalry, flyings, or even like land ones. That's not the great idea. You are not the tanky enough to tank it might touch uh, hits. Well, I think I was in a wrong place because whole fight just changed the location, and this guy wants to get killed. 
and I will be the one who will meet him. Right. He's baiting me. That's pretty obvious. I've got the right gear for any situation. Yeah. I was crying about where my alliance members and I just did not look the map because yeah, we had the conversation, yeah. Okay guys, I'm here. Right. Let's let's do some damage. Let's move away from, from the time bomb. This guy is overstepping. I, I can see it. But I think if I will use my inside here, we'll be fine. Ah, where is my artifact? Why do we need so much time to charge? Alright, I managed to use both of my artifacts. I was kinda getting targeted, but he was targeting my Nico and Kinara, and I have a good amount of counter attack damage there. So I just took. Yeah, that's the main reason like, I, I really really want to have Hosk because if I have Awakened Kinara then the Hosk should be my main choice, right? And uh, I'm not really sure how fast I will be Awakened in other legendary hero but I already started investing all my tokens towards Kinara that's why it's, it will be much better if I will finish it but yeah that's why, like, whenever I check my VIP shot, uh, shop, I, I avoid looking at the Hosk all the time. I just don't want to ruin my game plan. That's the main idea. Because I, I, I'm 100% sure I will have a lot of uh, fun playing with Hosk and Kinara while having a weekend Kinara for a free-to-play player. That's actually another dream, especially if you are Marksman main. Right. I wish I had artifact here, but let's try and go for some counter-attack damage. Yeah, I'm just standing and dealing some damage. I feel like you're far player here. Okay, let's just move back. No, not get too overexcited here. I still want to have some fun in these fights. Yeah, sometimes I lose control of the legions, that's the not good part. But yeah, there is a big difference between playing uh, on PC, on laptop, and playing on mobile. I would not recommend anybody to fight on mobile. Let's see if this guy has some... Okay. Don't run, don't run. Let's stay, let's stay. Let's try and use the artifact. Yeah, my alliance members are recharging, I guess. Well, Umbra just came. Yep, Nico actually has a pretty cool awakening skill. Uh, that's how I generally made my plan. Uh, like I had uh, in my mind the synergies from the defense break, and like Nico and Kinara is like more of a you know, skill damage uh, factor type of uh, marksman, right? And I think a lot of defense breaks has a great synergy between them even kinara has some defense break nico on his main skill that's why my general idea and plan was to have uh, nico and kinara awaken but yeah whenever i saw how good was Sindrion, i said maybe i will awaken kinara and then i will try to use all of my tokens on Sindrion. 
Yep, like skill damage factor marksmen are like another type. I wasn't expecting honestly to have uh, this new Rhaegar and Syndrome type marksman in the game. Zero skill damage factor, normal attack crits. Which is great, like uh, every single legion type has its own gameplay and their legion, like every single legion type has a different kind of gameplay by itself. That's the fun part about this game which I like and of course the combat is one of the best. Let's see the merits, 9000 here, uh, 15, uh, 8, 10, 19, 18, 19, well, nice. Nice. GG's. But until this legion is alive, I will stay here and then I'm not sure if I will be able to send more legions, but let's try to defend this builder and this tower as much as I can and then if I don't have any more legions and my hospital is full, I can't do anything right. Let's hit this infantry while we can. Yeah, if, if you had your host here and all of these guys were hitting you, like tons of merits, a lot of counter attack damage. Right, hitting the infantry is enough. This mage legion just moved up. Maybe a little bit more. Thanks. Now I will try to just move forward as much as possible. Yeah, your post would be amazing. Even if I had post with my Kinara would be amazing here, but yeah, tier 5 uh, post and Kinara, great, great, great. I, I'm having so much fun because as a marksman I'm able to hit uh, mages. That's never happened before. Yeah, I just made the one simple overstep, which fine because I used my shadow blades. Yeah, and Craig is almost done, which means Wyverns is finished. But still, yeah, like you are speaking about numbers regarding merits, which I need to send all of my four or five legions to get, and you got it from one husk. That's that's amazing. I I will try my best to wait for another um, artifact use, and simply because I have low health on my legions and. If I will be able to use my artifacts even at once, that will be pretty cool. Which I think I will. Unfortunately, the is gone. And I can do the Phoenix I Well, like, it's pretty obvious they have more people online. Right, Umbra is tanking, which means we can stand, we can attack. Let's try to use Phoenix Eye because it's an amazing place to do that. Okay, come on. Yeah, we used Phoenix Eye. And we used... Yeah, we actually used Shadow Blades too. Yeah, like I think I did my job. I stayed while Umbra was hitting and tanking. What else I can do more? I think like I will check how much merits I got out of this war. In total. Yeah, my Walder is kinda still alive, which is surprising while I'm getting targeted, but yeah. I guess I will have a lot more fun fighting against Sip. Let's see the merits. 
22, nice, from the mages, 24 from Nigo and Kinara, 14 for Sindrion, 11 simply because uh, I had way less uh, wyverns on my Thea Craig, 19 on Sindrion, well, honestly, I even I was not expecting that I would get that much merits out of this fight, simply because I have been always fighting against tier 5 players, um, but I think I got like somewhere like 300k merits out of this war. Well, I think if they improved uh, the artifact range, it would be overpowered, my friend. Like, can you imagine if uh, like marksmen were able to use the artifacts from that range? Like, mages would disappear, right? Especially for tier 5 players. If you guys have like 5 level artifacts and the best artifacts in the game with long range warfare, Okay, I, I understand you are losing some attack, but that would be our power. Like, uh, it would have a lot more drama because this game generally has more mage players and uh, they just simply did not want to make uh, uh, mages so it would be useless to play with, right? A lot of people would cry, a lot of uh, to win players will say that their game plan is ruined because they don't have yeah i think i'm gonna still send it i don't know why these guys are building near my town give me an idea for a story okay. i did not mean to get the forest calls uh, i'm using uh, the heart of gamasi on syndrion because uh, like for syndrion i think uh, he has Keen on his main skill, right? If I'm not mistaken. Keen and yeah, Heart of Gamas is giving Keen. Heart of Gamas is actually amazing artifact. This season I'm like using it my first time. And if I have at least a couple of uh, ranged legions nearby of the Heart of Gamas, I can feel how much damage I'm doing. That's like... That's what I mentioned a couple of times already. Like now I will turn it on. And let's see. Yeah. We'll be only using. Yeah. They are not focusing me. I don't know why. Until then, why not some free damage? Yeah, like, uh, especially if we will check the Heart of Gamasi, like, physical keen, 15% attack, and onslaught, uh, like, normal attack damage still 15%. For tier 5 units, that's a big, big amount of buff, in my opinion. Like, especially if you have your Syndrion, uh, like, Awakened with crits and Rhaegar in your, like, good uh, place. I think you are going to do a lot of damage. That's like, I think, for long-range warfare, the best artifact you can get. Also, you are getting some utility out of it, right? Because it's more defensive stats, uh, but... You are getting defensive stats, but from the skill, you are getting 15% uh, normal attacks and in general damage deal. For 10 seconds, I understand, like, 10 seconds might not sound a lot, but I think... Especially for, uh, for tier 5 player, 10 seconds is enough to... Gain a good amount of merits. Yeah, level level three. Yeah, like you can see, every um, like marksman artifact I have is level one. Shadow Blades level one. Heart of Kamas level one. Uh, of course, like Heart Cursor will be level five. Only artifacts I have uh, levels are. Okay, why we are hitting infantry is like phoenix eye i got lucky once it's level two tier of arbon which i didn't upgrade yet and uh, like uh, solan's blade level two that's the only uh, level two artifacts i got so yeah it's not looking good for me in terms of artifact luck why my syndrome is getting drunk and moving away i'm not sure but let's change position 
Like, I think especially if you are running a couple of marksman legions, you will love using Heart of Damas. It's just too much damage and too much survivability uh, as a marksman and like, yeah, you need, you need to stay alive on the battlefield to do more damage, right? And actually you are even receiving some damage from the uh, skill of the Gamasi. Hopefully I'm not picking... Let's just use everything here and then let's, let's call it a day. I did not watch the map, I could not see that they were coming so much. Yeah, maybe some counter-attack damage because we had marksmen. Let's see. I thought more uh, alliance members would join because we had some people here. Well, yet nice, nice numbers. I can't believe my eyes, but it's true. 10,000 from uh, Thea Craig, 18 from... Uh, Walter Welling, 20 from the best uh, legion I have, which is which should be normal. 11, 22, well, nice numbers, good numbers for me, uh, nice numbers for you, I guess. Months. Yeah, like, okay. Let's see long range warfare, my friend. And tier 5 players fighting against tier 5 players. <laughs> yeah, I got like 400k. Uh, I sent uh, my legions 4 times. Like 4 legions 4 times. That means 16 legions. From 16 legions, uh, I got 400k merits, which is nice. I think I will need approximately two days to empty my hospital, but I think once my uh, spearmen, which is my marksmen, and some wyverns will be ready, I will trade up go again. Because finally I can see that I'm doing something uh, on the battlefield. And of course I'm, I'm not going to stop here and arm. If... Uh, like maybe... Maybe... Okay, why only one? Come on. I tried my luck. And yet again, I'm unlucky. Only one elixir. Uh, 400 gems. Yeah, let's just buy this because... I don't know, we can. We can spend some merits. Maybe I can send uh, only like Sandrian and Fregar and Nigo and Kinara. Maybe. So I've heard. Let's check. Let's just heal it once. Yeah, I can. I think I can use two legions. That's the only... Okay, wait. Yeah. I guess... It was better to kill some wyverns. Well, that's like... It was like second or third time I used my gems for the... Um, refresh and most of the times I just got one elixir out of it. Which is not worth it. I will try and... Uh, Interrupt this little progression. Let's see how much merits I can get from two uh, legions. Of course, it would be much better for Hertz as one if I had a lot more ranged units. But it is what it is. Okay, now I'm getting hit. 
let's see let's uh, see how much counter attack damage i will do i made the actually wrong move why i'm here i don't know i thought like these guys were following me but i guess they did not come too fast i'm not going to hide in this alliance uh, member town i'm just interested how much damage i can get whenever i'm getting targeted by a couple of tier five tier four players my Nico and Kinara died pretty fast. Like I was expecting kinda more. But yeah, it's not close. Well... 11,000? 13? That was from Nico and Kinara, right? Um, yeah, from Nico it's 9 and uh, from the Walder because he was alive more. Uh, we got more. Yeah, I guess not bad. I guess finally I can uh, have some fun against like same similar power players. Uh, I will use my experience which I got from uh, fighting with and against tier 5 uh, players which is actually helping me. I, I'm not overextending. I guess yeah, these guys want to give me some merits. I can I cannot stop now. Now I can understand why you guys are hunting for merits. Like my hospital is full and I'm still standing here fighting for no reason. But yeah, my 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 caps are horrible. That's why it's better to go home. I I gave zero attention to cavalry units or heroes in this game um, I don't like the idea for tier 4 players now I need like 3 days if I want to get elixir uh, this season I have been trying to get some elixir um, villages which I had some success maybe I will find some more that's all I guess I can continue to fight even more uh, Thanks for watching, thank you Mons for being with me, I hope you will get soon back to your normal self, uh, illness is really bad, you don't like to be to stay in bed and has level less energy, so we should to get back to your normal self as, as fast as possible because we will need you, we will need your guidance in the future wars, and yeah for everybody who watched, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I like this game I, I will try to make some uh, more content because in general I think I got a new hobby uh, making videos I started this channel in order for me to just uh, do something else to not stop playing the game uh, because of the life and the work I don't have enough time to play other games which are consuming too much time uh, but yeah, I can play Call of Dragons, I still have interest after like one year of playing this game, like actually I have been playing this game uh, 345 days. And let's see how far I can go, uh, if I will be able to get some tier 5 unit, at least one, because units will be really really hard. So let's uh, see what's gonna happen, I'm always uh, thankful that you guys are with me on this journey. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope everybody is having a great morning, day, uh, evening, wherever you are. And yep, yeah, I'm 100% I'm, I'm getting even more than 1 million merits. Uh, like in this season, I will have a lot of merits. So let's, let's see if I will keep my word, my friend. And uh, yet again, thanks for watching and get, get well, my friend. Bye-bye. Uh, see you very, very soon.